our video editors to another useful broadcast edit tip. Today I'm going to tell you a cautionary tale and a solution. How many times has a client said, can you grab something from YouTube and use it in their film? Hmm, maybe it's just scratch footage that they're going to replace, or maybe it's one of their films that they want to incorporate into the edit that you're doing. What's the best way to grab something from YouTube and use it in Final Cut Pro? Well, it used to be really easy. There was a fantastic piece of software that's just called Clip Grab. But for me, and I'm not the most technical savvy person, and if you work for ClipGrab, please leave a comment and explain why it no longer works. It was so easy. You just put in the URL, it downloaded an HD version of your film in QuickTime in .mov format, and you could edit with it. But either it's my Mac Mini M1 software, or it just stopped working. So I started looking around for an alternative piece of software that would grab, rip, whatever you wanted to call it, stuff from YouTube that I could use in Final Cut Pro. Enter the world of nightmare. It seems that grabbing something from YouTube is seen as bad. So all the software companies who let you do it give you malware. If you type in best YouTube grab software, oh boy, don't go there. Most of them are spammy malware. It's really not a good idea. So my only solution was to use QuickTime screen record, and that works great. It records whatever you see on the screen as a QuickTime movie. Mute. <laughs> yeah, it used to be, before I had the M1 and the latest Big Sur software, there was a patch you could let QuickTime use internal audio from your Mac. Now, again, I'm not totally tech savvy and I believe there is software that lets you patch internal audio to QuickTime. But I think it also costs quite a lot of money and it was just beyond me because QuickTime only records silent, mute, no audio from your screen record. Most of the time that's fine. In fact, I don't want the damn audio. But sometimes I want to record the entire film. So my quest began to find unmalware, unspammy, clip grab replacement software that can grab a URL from YouTube and save it with audio and pictures in HD as a quick time movie. And I think I've done it. After sadly suffering the malware software, I found this one. It's called 4K Video Downloader. Now, I have no association with it. Uh, it could still be naughtyware for all I know, but it really does work. I think it cost me nothing. I think you can maybe contribute to it, but they have good support. There's training videos. The training videos do still seem to have an Eastern European accent, but there's nothing wrong with Eastern European people as long as their software isn't naughty. And 4K video downloader seems to work really well. All you do is go and look at the YouTube film you want, open 4K video downloader, and it parses or knows the last thing you saw on YouTube and just downloads it. There is one further step, and it just might be me, but this is a step I find I need to go through. It downloads it pretty quick, depending on your internet speed, in a format that Final Cut Pro doesn't really like. So I open the file on my Mac, it opens with QuickTime, export it as a HD 1080 QuickTime movie. And there on my desktop is a copy of the YouTube film in HD with audio. And that's my tip for the day. I'm sure there's probably better or alternative ways to do it. Please leave a comment below with what you do to grab stuff from YouTube. But this works for me. Thank <laughs> you.